Hi guys, this is Abhi from Gokche DB. In this video, you're going to learn six things about exception handling in Ruby. Number one, let's start with an example. Here, I'm trying to open the file a.txt and if it opens successfully, I print the message open successfully. Now watch what happens if I change the name of the file to something that does not exist. My program crashes with the exception no such file or directory. Number two, use the rescue clause to capture an exception. In this example, I added a rescue clause with an error number, which will catch our exception and prevent the program from crashing. Note if you use the rescue clause without any specific errors, then it will capture all types of exceptions. Number three, use the retry keyword in the rescue block to re-execute the begin block after the exception is caught. Here I'm retrying the begin block after every second until a1.txt file is found. I'm going to revert back the file name before we move on to the next pointer. Number four, use the raise keyword to raise a custom exception. On line 35, I'm raising a custom exception with the message number cannot be zero if the input underscore num is equal equal to zero. Number five, the ensure block always gets executed irrespective of whether the exception was caught or not. Last but not the least, number six, the else block gets executed only when no exceptions were raised. There you have it. Make sure you like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell. Until next time.